Hi, my name is Tusharika Vig. I'm currently interning under Supreme Court Bar Association Vice President Pradeep Rai. Uh, first of all, I'd like to congratulate uh, Honorable Justice D. Y. Chandrachud for being elected as the next Chief Justice of India. In the past, we have noticed uh, he's been part of notable judgments like the landmark 2018 377 judgment, and I hope through this appointment he. Uh, helps in contributing towards wider representation of the lgbtqi community and granting them a wider uh, wider angle of rights and even in the sphere of women's rights and children's rights recently in a judgment in the past month we saw uh, we saw abortion rights being expanded so i hope through this appointment we move towards a better future in granting women uh, sexual autonomy and reproductive rights hello everyone uh, i am vedant rajan currently i am in my fifth year of law school i am currently interning under uh, senior advocate pradeep rai who is also the vice president of the supreme court bar association i'd like to offer my heartiest congratulations to uh, justice uh, uh, dy chandrachud who is now elected as the uh, chief justice uh, uh, we have we have witnessed uh, him always being a protector of media rights as well as a um, protector of journalists where he was one of the sole dissenters of the bhima koregaon case as well as uh, one of the fundamental uh, elements to ensure uh, arnab goswami got bail in his case so with this appointment uh, we hope that uh, more such uh, 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 more such instances like this are witnessed wherein journalists and uh, uh, and people who dissent against the government are given uh, more voice and liberty uh, in the state my name is darshita p i currently interning under supreme court bar association vice president pradeep rai sir senior advocate first of all our heartiest congratulations to justice dy chandrachud uh, for being appointed as the next uh, chief justice of india we look forward uh, to uh, indian uh, to indian judicial system uh, to be administered under you sir and uh, lot of uh, appointments or lot of developments that uh, are that can come like one of uh, one of the developments would be uh, the indian prison system and its uh, and its liberty of uh, about how we were uh, we were highlighted about it uh, when you to when you spoke about how everybody has the liberty to uh, live under under article 21 and even one day without that liberty is sometimes is sounds like too many days so um indian prison systems are uh, overcrowded and we look forward to more reformation hi everyone my name is yash yeah. currently i am interning under senior advocate who is also the vice president of supreme court bar association pradeep rai sir now i want to cong- congratulate the justice dy chandrachud who is going to be the next chief justice of india uh, he is the part of many landmark judgments Uh, some of them are is the uh, uh, ayodhya verdict which basically resolved a decade uh, old dispute regarding the land and secondly in the justice puttu swami versus union of india he pointed out that the right to privacy constitute a fundamental right under article 21 of the constitution and in another judgment he allowed the women to get the uh, permanent postings in the army so all in all i can say that all in all i can say that the future of judiciary is in the good hands of the our next cgi